Since the 2011 overthrow of autocrat Zain El Abidin Ben Ali, Tunisia has achieved free elections, a new constitution, and a spirit of compromise that is between secular and Islamist parties. However, since early 2016, social pressure over job has, or rather jobs has exploded into mass protests, a reminder of the conditions that helped the, to inspire uh, the Tunisian revolution. Now, in a recent interview with VOS Mohammed El Shinawe, Fadel El, uh, Abdel Kafi, Tunisia's Minister of Development, Investment and International Cooperation, talked about opportunities his country offers for foreign, uh, foreign investors, especially uh, those from the United States. When we came one month ago to the government, we started by uh, going through a parliament and we had the green light for this new uh, investment uh, law. Uh, this is to, to have a fast track and a one-stop shop for these investors. And as I said, uh, today Tunisia need to have an investment from private sector, locally and uh, overseas. And uh, our aim is to explain to our friends that Tunisia could be a gateway to the MENA region, to Africa also. We are improving in uh, security, really, uh, since one year and a half, I would say. But uh, we need more uh, more commitment from our friends to help uh, Tunisia to, to be a, in a better situation. As you know, Tunisia is not very far from Europe, and the security of Europe is also the security of Tunisia. Well, that was Fadel Abdel Kafi, Tunisia's Minister of Development, Investment and International Cooperation.